That's right, bitch! And lastly, but not least, there's a patio. There's not really anything out there right now, but you're welcome to decorate it however you want. Well, the place is great, but I gotta ask, um, why are you looking for a new roommate so immediately? Well, my current roommate got a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity in California, which is great, but now I only have two weeks to find someone new. So you could say that you're kind of desperate? Sure. Okay, well, me too, because I have to move out of my place in nine days. Why? Well, my roommate thinks that I have rescued one too many cats, which is ridiculous because you can't have too many cats. How many cats do you have? Well, well only six of them are actually mine, and then the other eight are just fosters. That, that's 14 cats. Well, most of them are litter trains, so you don't even have to worry about it. How did you even end up with that many cats? I take it upon myself to watch my neighbors and make sure that they are good for families. And if they're not, I quietly take the kitten from their position. So, but I, I, I like to think of myself like a, a vigilante CPS, like a, like a cat protection services. Here. This is Mr. Foxy's cat cat sneaker button smash. He's my favorite. Well, I'll, I'll let you know. I'll let you know if you get the apartment. Okay. Well, we'll be waiting. <laughs> Hi, my name's Jerry. You can call me Jer. Okay, Jer, come on in, man. Dude, sweet place. I could totally nest here. Well, I'm looking for a roommate pretty soon. Do you have a job? I'm a big boy. I pay my own bills. I'm a botanist. So do you farm or garden? Started my own green room, bro. Working from home like a gnome. Wait, I wonder what gnomes do. Do they need money, or do they like live in a commune of communists? Well, gnomes don't exist. And even if they did, I don't know what socio-political system they would establish. I bet it's really nice. Okay, okay. W what do you grow, bro? Purple Monkey Funk, Himalayan Donkey Punch Kush, Triple Dipper Nightmare, and uh, Heirloom Tomatoes. I'll give you a discount on the grain, but the tomatoes are mine. You do realize that weed is still illegal here in Texas? That's why I moved to Austin, bro. All of us Cali people are moving here and now we're a colony of California. All legal, all legit. You do realize that's not how legalization or colonization works? You're not a cop, are you? I'm gonna have to search you, sir. <laughs> And this is the place. Okay. I have to ask. Are you a fan? Of? <laughs> My show, silly. Do you live under a rock? I'm kind of a celebrity YouTuber. I make original musical medleys. Well, I'm not much of a musical person. You will be. You will be. Just watch this and you will thank me later. I am not throwing away my shot. I am not throwing away my, my, my. How can I resist ya? Mamma mia, does it show again? My, my, just how much I miss. My cavities, a mystery cat. He's very tall and very thin. Popular, <gasps> you're gonna be popular. Well, that was fantastic, brilliant, fantastical, earth-shattering, fabulous, loud. Are you gonna be making those noises in this apartment? I hope you know that I have over 63,422 subscribers on my channel who would die to have me make my loud noises that my voices produces. I thought this was gonna be a, 
a Good Morning Baltimore moment, but this is obviously a Bye Bye Birdie moment. Uh, are you okay? I'm fine. I simply broke my leg at my latest art installation piece. I was trying to fight the notion that air signs can't commit by committing myself to suspending in the air for three days straight. I'm an Aquarius with a Gemini rising and a Libra moon, so naturally it was very important work for me. Sorry to hear about that. It looks like you overcommitted. The only thing I need less than your sarcasm is your pity. Sorry, my bad, dude. I'll forgive you only because I am so focused on my healing that I can't fully digest your careless cruelty. Thank you. Anyways, I want to rent your spare room for my newest art installation. It is going to be a 24-hour open admission installation for three months long. For the first month, I'm going to be gluing animal pelts to my skin and then slowly tearing them off to illustrate the cruelty of hunting for sport. And the second month? I will be inviting all of my ex-lovers to come make love to me and then fight about our previous relationship to illustrate the dangers of sleeping with your exes. Do I even want- And then the third and final month, I'm going to be setting and smoldering small fires while screaming the names of my middle school classmates. And that one I'm going to leave up for interpretation. Yeah. You need to leave. Some people just don't understand art. You okay? need help? I'm fine, thank you. You have any pets? Nope. Do any drugs? No, it's not really my game. Any weird performance art with sex, fur, or fire? No, I'm sorry, actually, uh, I'm pretty boring. Um... No, 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 that's, that's perfect, actually. Yeah, I, yeah, I think, yeah. Well, okay. okay. I got a rouge, my knees, and pull my stockings down. You know all that jazz. You're the one that I want? You are the one I want. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey. And you, and you, and you, you're gonna love me.